No. Did you think of us to make the single back or not? Oh, did you all give it up to me? No. Yes. But mine is down here. No. It's everything. No, it's everything. Yeah. Maybe no, this, maybe this is yours. The no. back one is definitely one. Yeah, we'll take this one. Okay. Right, okay, so uh, if we look at A1. I have the book in paper. Yeah, what's, what's the problem? I took it. Do you need to be talking right now or could you be quiet? You could be quiet? Great. Right, so A1 here, if we had a table. Huh? I'm using yours right now because I don't have one. If I wasn't planning on doing this, uh, you have a table and um, you have your um, reaction here at A and a reaction here at B. Uh, KJ, would you move? And then you have a weight in the middle of 5.5 g, and this is 0.2 of a meter. And this here is one meter, and this here is 0.5 of a meter. And this question is find the force A and B. And this is so basic. It's so basic. And um, this is your usual up equals down. A plus B equals 5.5 G. And then the turning force. So if I take it from A, is this clockwise or anti-clockwise? Clockwise. And, and and no, clockwise. clockwise. Yeah. Uh, so it's the distance multiplied by 5.5 g. Now you just have to be careful. The total length is 1.7, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Half of 1.7 is 0 0.85. Yeah. Yeah. So it's 0 0.85 to the middle here. And here is 0.2. So what's this distance here? 0.65. 0 0.65. So 0.65 times 5.5 g. This one here um, is on the uh, anti-clockwise, so it's on the other side of the equals 1 times b. Which one do you think? This one now. Oh, oh sorry. Uh, oh, yeah, it's b. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, So, I can easily, so easily, get the B. The B is 35.1 newtons. And if I put the B in here, I can get the A. A is 18.9 newtons. Did you get something like this? No. Terrible. That's terrible. This is a very straightforward question. Did anybody get this? I do my system, but I forgot that you can make this straightforward. Did anybody get this? Did you get this, Tekken? No. No, no. It's yes or no. <laughs> you have the answer in front of you. Did you get this? Yes. No. Why not? Zero point two. Why zero point two? Did you take this as the turning point? Did you take this as the turning point? Mm -hmm. That's fine. You should get the same answer though. Did you not? You didn't get B is thirty five point one. What did you get for B? What did you get? And what did you get for A? No, because if you add those two together, you don't get 5.5 g. So you solved your equations incorrectly because you, you need the a plus b to equal 5.5 g. Guys, oh my goodness, this is 